Guess what? Yep. I'm gonna film the YouTube video I've been putting off. Am I in it? Yeah. Is this it right now? Mm hmm. Today I'm gonna answer some questions that you guys asked me on Instagram and I'm gonna dye my hair. She needs a little refresher. This is Haley Williams Good Dye Young Company in the color Rock Lobster. The questions are on my phone, so the rest of this will be filmed on my computer. I'll see you guys in the bathroom. Hmm. This lighting is not the best, but what am I gonna do? Move a whole lamp in here? No. It's the bathroom, you know? The girls are warm. Ooh, sleek. Nice. Whoa. There's no directions. What? There's no directions in here. Here it is. Okay. You're supposed to lighten your hair first, but I've been dyeing my hair with stuff I got from Walgreens for so long, and I'm afraid that it might all fall off if I try to bleach it now. Okay. Fit check. Today we are wearing the t-shirt of my friend's college acapella group. The Troy Tones. There's no gloves in this. I'm just gonna go for it. Sorry. Oh, I'm supposed to be answering questions. Favorite movie soundtrack? Um, definitely the soundtrack to Spirit, Stallion of the Cimarron. Wes Richardson, a former member of the Troy Tones, says, how are you so cool and awesome? <laughs> I don't know. What's my favorite part of every song on my EP? Let's find out. So the EP, of course, on self-loathing, produced by Mr. Bobby Rethwish. Listen to it. This is my favorite part of Nothing Even Wrong. I know what it looks like. I know it looks like I'm listening to my own music while I get ready. I'm not. Jenna, what's your favorite song off the EP? Um, honestly, I don't know the name of some of your songs. Jenna! <laughs> let, me, let me look. I do have a favorite. All right, this is how we're doing it. We're just... <gasps> Yeah, I did it in the disaster video and it turned out okay. This is red red. This is... Oh, I'm gonna mess with the camera. I do really love your song, Disaster. Oh, uh, we were just talking about it. It's so good. <laughs> I, you. It is bomb. Thank you. Shout yeah. out to Lena Kay and Zoe Benson who wrote that song. Oh, actually, I think someone asked me. Who asked? Oh, no, I didn't think this through. I can't touch the computer. Can you do me a favor? Oh, man. Tell us about the writing process behind Disaster. Shh. Ow. Sorry, it's so stupid. The door. Oh, are you okay? Basically, long story short, I was in Austin, Texas. I was feeling pretty sad. I went to a cemetery to seek advice from the dead, and I brought my guitar, like the little indie sad girl that I am, and I sat on a tomb, and I started writing it, and I thought it was really bad, and then I came back to LA, and I sat down with Max Leon, Zoe Benson, and Lena Kay, and we drank a bunch of wine and finished it out. And they helped me like shape it. And there's a whole chapter about it in my journal if you <laughs> want to buy it. It's on my, it's below. Anyway, plugging Jenna's art here. Mm. Um, can you open up the questions again? I guess so. Oh, speak of the devil. Lena just texted me. Do I think about going on tour in other countries? Yes. What country are you in? I'll go. I will go wherever, whenever, as soon as we can. Because I've been in this house for too long. <gasps> I'm gonna have to hang out here. I guess so. Shantanu Dukst says, what lessons would you give to your 16 year old self? That's so deep. Mostly just like, it's not a big deal. It's not a big deal. Don't freak out. It doesn't fucking matter. That would be my main advice to me now too, probably. I caught red handed. <laughs> I didn't know you were gonna be here. Um, My advice? My 16 year old self? I would probably say being cool is overrated, you know? Don't it's try true. don't try to fit in. Stick out because that's what makes you cool and unique. Who would I like to collab with? That's easy. Charlie XCX, on Ivor, <laughs> Jimmy Stack, Little Sims, York, Arca, so many people. Me. <laughs> Jenna, <laughs> Jenna and I are gonna work on something that's a surprise for later. Ginger Bassist asks, what is consciousness? 
Oh. Um. Are we conscious right now? Pain. Tell me the truth. Should I dye my eyebrows too? No. <laughs> okay. Not today. Let me help you out. Thank then. you. <laughs> I can't touch anything. <laughs> Olive reviews, Jess. <sighs> Disgusting. What? We've talked about this previously on our live, and Jess is a fan of olives. Disgusting. I love olives. Yeah, Jess. <laughs> Are we alone in the universe? Did you yes. see Susical the Musical? I don't actually believe that. Alone in the universe. Did you ever see Susical the Musical? Oh, hell yeah. Yeah. There's always a Horton for every who. How did life evolve from non-living matter? Let's see, I think I can touch it now. How was your day? It was good. What did we do? We got fast food. What? What'd you do? Nothing. Did you stain our <laughs> sink? No. I just got a new job and I work from home and yeah, it's fun. McCall lives here. I have a friend here all day. <laughs> You're telling me. I'm normally alone with the cats. Lydon asks, how is the process of making on self-loathing different from under the rain. It was very different. Under the rain I made over the course of a couple of years while I was in college. Stone Cold was made by Grant and Jameson because they needed to make it for a class. So anyway, that process was more like scattered and spaced out over a couple of years, whereas on self-loathing I wrote with the intention of having it be a body of work. And you just <laughs> looking up on the bottom of the screen is so funny to me. <laughs> Huh. And totally overtake your um ding. Oh no, this is gonna be so Yeah, bad. I'm uh <laughs> I'm this definitely is... laughing because especially like right here on the no. side. <laughs> on self loathing I made knowing it was gonna Kelsey! Go away. Turn your notifications off, dude. Oh. Anyway, I had a thought process behind on self loathing and I only worked with Bobby on it rare as I worked with a bunch of people on Under the Rain. <sighs> That's the answer. Oren Jacobson, how are you such a musical genius? When can we expect more masterpieces from you? Oh my god, don't boost her ego. <laughs> What's wrong with that? <laughs> um, <laughs> more music is coming very soon. It's pretty cool. Thanks for the glowing review. <laughs> was there anything from On Self Loathing that was cut in the process? Yes, a lot was cut in the process. How would you pronounce the word caramel from my sister Kelsey? Caramel. Do you have a problem with that? No, I say I say caramel. I had to think about it though. <laughs> Last but not least, Coleman Haynes asks, where do you get the nerve? And he followed up with, who the hell do you think you are? And also, what gives you the right? That was good. <laughs> I like how you recorded this whole thing on photo booth. <laughs> what else was I gonna use? Do you have a camera? No. Okay, I need I'm. A ring light. Sorry, continue. <laughs> I do have a ring light. I just didn't want to bring it into the bathroom because then it's like I brought a ring light into my bathroom. How embarrassing. There's a reason that I use in bathrooms. No. All right, I'm gonna try to wash the sink and my skin. <laughs> What is this for? <laughs> you know, when you need some acetone. I have a lot of chem- I have turpentine, I have mineral oils. Ooh, it's working, I think. Yeah, you never know when you need a chemical. <laughs> I guess. <laughs> oh my god. It looks like you- <laughs> Looks like what? <laughs> it looks like you have a rash. <laughs> I think it's gonna turn out great. Wait, so what is this video? This is an interlude, a cleaning the sink interlude, you know. Where I did the lid go? The lid. Is oh, this the right lid? Here. The lid. No, the <laughs> lid. No, the lid. <laughs> the lid. The lid. Back from the shower, I... It definitely stained a little bit, but... I'm gonna answer some more questions. Put the acoustic version of Disaster on TikTok on YouTube, I beg you. Fine. Jess also asked, how do you approach production in comparison to songwriting? Production is more just little bits every day whereas with songwriting it's more just kind of like a train of thought so it's a lot slower when i'm producing than when i'm writing but i like it guitar chords for without even trying okay dj rana official what are the chords let's find out but we're in open d tuning we're out of tune but we're close to that you're gonna start open and just capo two 
you're gonna go two, four. And then bring it down. And then go to fret five. Repeats and then the chorus, you're going up here, fret nine, seven, five, and you're just plucking the top two strings and the bass. Not that big a reveal because my hair's still wet. You can't really tell. Let's see what Jenna thinks. Jenna! Aww. What do you think? Well, what? Well, my hair. I like it. It doesn't look any different. Um, I didn't want to say that. <laughs> it looks exactly the same. Darker? I guess. I was trying to make it brighter, though. <laughs> oh. <laughs> oh, well. At least my roots are done. Yeah. Thank you for your participation. Bye. Bye. So, yeah. I'll insert a clip when it's dry. Maybe it'll look a little better then. Pretty much exactly the same. I didn't really change the color at all. In their defense, they did say I needed to lighten it first, and I didn't listen. So, good night. Thank you for your questions.